So today we are gonna be a diva <laughs> and try the diva cup. Because personally, I have tried the tampon. I usually use a pad, but tampons, I I just don't like them. Like, I like it once I've done it, but I don't like pulling it out, and I do not like putting it in. Like, those two just, ah, I just, I don't know why, I just can't get myself to love it or do it. But it is a nice result when you do it, because you don't really feel it. But then again, I'm always stressed, oh my god, is my string still there? Did it, like, fall off? Is it gonna rip off? Like, I'm always just stressed with a tampon. And pads are just gross, because every time you go to the bathroom, you pretty much, you know, you see that. So, I wanted to try this Diva Cup right here. I've seen several YouTubers try this out, and you can wear this for 12 hours. It's designed for people, you know, who are very active, which is really nice. So I'm gonna be testing that out as well. I'm gonna go to a fit boxing class, which is super intense. And we're just gonna be really just testing this out to see if it's better than all pads and all tampons. So what it claims to do, comfortable, clean, and easy to use. Leak proof protection for up to 12 hours at a time. 100% silicone, no color, no plastic, no BPA, or latex. And it's also reusable, which I think is really, really cool. If you look on the side right here, they have one, which is the one I got, the little check, um, which was people for under 30, and this one's for over 30. So obviously I got the one for under 30. So now that we've learned a little about it, I, let's, ah, let's just do this. Ooh, whoa, it's really, really silky. There's little measurements on here, which is kind of odd, kind of interesting at the same time. But it's a very interesting material. It kind of reminds me of the Scylla sponge, like the makeup applicator. I'm gonna go rinse this with some really hot water to just, you know, make sure there's nothing on it. You know, just in case they, I don't know who do, I don't know who touched this when they were making it. I'm turning it all the way on hot water. Ooh, that water is so hot. I'm just gonna towel dry this. Whoa, I'm just realizing something. I don't know if you can see this fully, but there are little holes like every, I'd say an inch or so, around the Diva Cup. I wonder why. Like, cause they're like full holes, you know what I mean? Interesting. Definitely a little nervous right now. But like, I'm also not. So there's two options to fold. The first one, I don't really like. The second one I'm gonna do, it's kind of like a little like sandwich burrito is what I'd call it. I'm actually gonna put my hair up just so you know. Nothing happens. It's definitely a little hard to bend into the position. That's not very small. I'm gonna kind of get it slightly wet so maybe it's a little more slippery because like, I'm not scared. I'm just like, I don't get how it's gonna fit. <sighs> I tried this thing, Diva Cup, for like three, no, I'd say like more like four minutes. And then I was kind of thinking while I was doing this, which you should never do, but I was thinking about all the bad things that could happen. And what if it gets like, like, like I can't pull it out, like it's, it gets that far up, because there's no string. It's just like this little tiny tab at the bottom. Let's just compare size. Unfolded, folded. Like, as you can see, it's almost like two tampons. So like, if it's hard for you to put in a tampon, I think it's gonna be even harder for you to put this in because it keeps on unfolding like it just did. And it just got me wet because I just washed it, ew. Um, but yeah, I'd say a tampon is easier and I don't think I was gonna come out saying that. I was thinking I'd really love this. I'm obviously gonna keep it in this little pouch just in case one day I get the courage and strength to do it again. I have a feeling I know why the item was on sale because it was on sale, it was $10 off. I think people just don't love it. I say stay with the pad for as long as you are like so irritated with the pad that you're just like, I am gonna put this in. But you have to be really, really confident when you're gonna put in a tampon and do not hesitate. You just have to do it. It's kind of like with the Diva Cup, but it just kept on unfolding and then I had to rinse it out and it was just like a hassle pretty much. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna stick with pads and a tampon. But yeah, sorry that this video was kind of a fail, but I honestly tried to try it out. It just, it wasn't for me. Yeah, but thank you so much for watching. I love you so much and 